In today's video, we will tackle the common Valorant issue where the game experience slow loading or get stuck on the loading screen. By following these steps, you can rest assured that your problem will be resolved. Step number one, right click on Valorant, then go to the properties, then capabilities and select run as administrator. It's easy just click or open the explorer then go into the c drive if you have a shortcut on your desktop that's more easy but if you don't have then you need to follow this step write games then valorant live and here is the valorant right click on it go into the properties now capability make sure select here change settings for all users disable full screen optimization and run the program as an administrator also change the uh, high dpi settings and then override high dpi scaling behavior scaling performed by applications now one more thing i'm gonna include here if we are gonna check here the run this program as an administrator then we need to do this with the second application shooter games binary win64 and find here the valorant win64 shipping so this will work more better capability then uh, change settings for all users and apply the same settings disable full screen optimization run this program as an administrator change high dpi and uh, check this option and select here the application and click ok hit apply ok and that's it our first step has done now let's move on the step number two if you are using any third party antivirus like Avast or McAfee, temporarily disable it as antivirus programs can sometimes be the cause of this issue. So make sure disable those antivirus and then try to start your Valorant. Now step number 3, disable certain background process in Windows optional features that may be causing conflicts. These include Hyper-V virtual machine platform, Windows hypervisor platform and Microsoft Defender application card so what we are gonna do here uh the easiest step on windows 10 just click on the windows icon then go into the settings you can also apply the same settings on windows 11 as well okay now go into the apps once you are here on the left side you will see here the apps and features just click on it and once you over there now here you can see optional features now on the left top corner more windows features and here you need to uncheck the Hyper-V and then scroll down a bit until you will get here the virtual machine platform and Windows hypervisor platform. You need to uncheck these options and in Windows 10 might be you are facing this feature the Microsoft Windows Defender application guard so also uncheck this option as well. Okay, after doing this your problem should be fixed 100% but one more thing we are gonna include here which is a command prompt just launch your cmd as an administrator and as i said make sure always run as administrator like windows then system 32 sometimes you launch it as administrator but it's still showing you like windows then user that's not like the exact way if you are facing this issue simply you need to open the explorer c drive users then uh, sorry not users windows then system 32 folder now find here the cmd and open it from here this will work the perfect perfectly all right now here we need to apply a command which uh, is over here i have already copied you can copy it from description i just put it over there go ahead copy it dc d edit space slash set space hypervisor launch type space of and hit enter the operation completes successfully now what you need to do just restart your pc first and then try to launch your valorant this will solve your problem i hope so now step number four consider checking your dns settings as sometimes issue can be resolved by adjusting dns configurations check out or dedicated video on finding the best dns tool for your internet not tool actually the finding the best dns anyways uh link is mentioned in the description just go ahead watch that video it's more helpful if you don't have the best dns in your pc okay step number five the if the program if the problem persists navigate to the riot games this time 
C Drive, Riot Games, Valorant, Live. And this time you need to delete this mini fest debug files. This will solve your problem, hopefully. And after deleting this, you can just try to launch your Valorant. I hope this will solve your problem. Now, if you are still facing this, let's move on to step number six, which is more importantly, lastly, addressing any Vanguard related issue. Open command prompt as an administrator. And as I said, administrator means Windows System 32. All right. Now, open command prompt as an administrator and use the following commands. The first command is sc space delete vgc and second sc delete vgk and hit enter. Now simply you need to restore your PC and try to delete the Vanguard folder which is over here program files x86 right all right it's now over here program files so here is the right vanguard we need to delete this but we cannot delete this actually because it's still running on the background don't worry just go over there and you can see here the excite exit vanguard just do it yes once you have done this now try boom your problem solved now what we are gonna do here we need to install it back just launch your right client and this will automatically install the uh right vanguard and after the installation just you can that's it now after the login it will automatically install what the hell that's insane guys when you have a lot of guns and you just forget the password all right it's working now you can see i have update just click on the update this time right vanguard is uh dart anti-cheat system designed to uphold the highest level of competitive integrity for our of offering so we need to update it it's not working so again i need to restart my pc all right now your game required is system restart to play please restart your computer if this issue continue reach out to our player support team so simply i need to restart my pc and this uh, will solve the issue now by following this step your valorant loading issue should be resolved if you have any question or con or suggestion feel free to leave them in the comment your feedback is highly appreciated see you in the next video till then allah peace bye bye